What is up guys, good morning, it's another day in my life and today we're gonna go check out the Superman set that we have in downtown Cleveland. They're filming a new movie and I think I'm starring in it so I'm gonna go check it out. All right guys, we're in front of the set right now. I'm late for filming practice but we're gonna go walk through and make sure that nobody yells at me because I don't wanna get in trouble. So I think these are the cameras, I'm not really sure. It's insane that they have these, these cranes to hold them up. But over here, what they did earlier was they shut the street down. It was actually kind of nuts. And there was a bunch of rubble and some Humvees and some police cars. Let's see if they still have them over there. Okay, we couldn't find the full set, but we're gonna head to the mall and see if I can get some new outfits. And then we'll be hanging out with a few friends and then we'll see what the day has for us. I started the stock portfolio in the beginning of the year with a thousand. We're at thirty-four thousand. We're up like fourteen, fifteen hundred a day already. It's pretty good. All right, we're about to get some MMA reps in with my boy Alonzo. We're about to get some groundwork, some jiu-jitsu in. Alonzo is a killer, so you guys are gonna be in for a treat today. Huh? You training? Yeah. in the cage and now we're about to go back home we got an agency call so on the weekends where we really get our sauce in so stay tuned all right so i want to reverse engineer how to build a deal really you want to do about 20 million in, in, in annualized production that's the goal okay that's 1.83 million a month okay so the big thing i want to talk about when it comes to instagram when it comes to posting whichever way you do it sunny i know you do your own thing post your lifestyle All right, we're going to the sneaker shop right now. I don't even know who this is or what this is, but they got some shoes. All righty. No, Amy's here. Come on, man, you're late, man. 12.03. All right, so what do they got here? This is for real the last place I should be. Why are these so expensive? I'm looking at all these shoes. They're kind of cool. That's crazy. Are they? These look nice, Asics. Why are these so expensive? These used to be like 20 bucks back in the day. We could make these in China for like 10 bucks. These look cool. There's so many pairs of these. Do you have any uh, Kobe's up there? Yeah. Are you Kobe's? Dude, I know nothing about shoes, Gabe. Yeah, these are Kyrie's. Oh, you're right, they are Kobe's. Why am I, why am I tripping? That is a cool store, man. Thank you. It's dope. I'm not someone that like buys a lot of shoes. These shoes I have on are 20 bucks. Literally, like they're like, they're like 20 bucks a pop, right? It's kind of like a waste of money sometimes, don't you think? Salutations, everybody. Can you hear me? In third place, we've got none other than Dean coming in with $7,683 in business. That's insane, man. So we got number two coming in here. This guy's been dropping a lot of content on social media. His name is Lewis. He's got $12,000 in uh, business, right? a little bit over $12,500. We got Jaron over here with $18,916 in business. This is, this is a lot of business, Jaron. How are you doing it? So when it came to sales, he talked a lot about mental toughness and personality. And here's the craziest part of what he did during his presentation. So he would recruit the sales, the policyholders, family to help them to help him grow his agency. All right, guys. So we just completed our sales call. It was a lot of fun. I like to give the guys as much sauce as possible. Also, guys, when I talk about sauce, I talk about the skill set, you know, the secret, the hidden juice. That's what sauce is. Hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. Very good seeing you. Good Very morning. good. Guys, this is Mumu. What's going on, guys? Mumu is unemployed. He pays for everything. And he pays pay for everything, right. Hey, let me ask you a question, Mumu. Yeah. As, a, as a father of multiple children, how, how, how involved <laughs> should you be in your children's lives? I think it's better to not be involved at all. I think maybe in the beginning at birth, you know, the doctors and the nurses and the wife can feel better. But after that, I feel like you should just not be involved because it gives them character, it teaches them how to be on their own. Now, uh, if you had any advice for a woman that was in her early 20s, what would you say? Get pregnant as soon as possible. I think if you go out one night and then you find someone, um, get pregnant, have a kid, and then 
corner yourself because it will push you, it will motivate you. And the best thing to do after pregnancy is? Yeah. Get pregnant again. Okay. <laughs> okay. Right after. Okay, you heard it here, folks. I mean, a lot of good information. <laughs> a lot of good information. So, all right, obviously, that's a joke. I was raised by a single mom. I don't recommend just going out and getting pregnant. Guys, guys, he has no idea what he's talking about. Don't, 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 don't. Different people have different opinions. You know, I like to get people's opinions, but I think the large majority of people to just focus on building themselves up emotionally, physically, spiritually. If you're a young girl in your 20s, probably not a good idea to just go get pregnant right off the rip. We're gonna go shopping at the mall. We're gonna have some fun. We're gonna pick out some outfits and then we'll go from there, all right? All right, we are downtown Cleveland. We're about to go to the mall. There's a lot of stuff going on. Checking around here. There's food trucks, there's police officers, there's filming. I think they're shutting down the street to uh, film the Superman movie that I'm supposed to be in, but I'm taking time off work. Put that camera up. I live there. All right, guys, we are at the mall right now. We're going to wreak some havoc. Not really. We're just going to get some outfits. But, you know, hopefully people don't say anything to me and yell at me because that's what typically happens. But we'll see what happens. Oh, man, I'm losing so much money. Thirty hours later, I told her. But it was my boss. This is tough. Who paid this money? Who paid this money for this? Two dollars in my country. <laughs> This is actually lit. Purple? But it is not purple. It's black. But it is black. But it is not purple. How can they lie? How can they lie to me? How can they lie? <laughs> this is lying. Brand should be named Liar. Something that's like, I, I don't know, I think this is You need some more overcoat. We're gonna get an outfit here. Zara, so that was gonna take me out an outfit. So let's see what she's got. Okay, so me. They're getting heavy. <laughs> Alright, look. Okay, so me. I like that a lot, it's good. All right guys, we're gonna end the vlog here early because I gotta get to my meeting and I'm super late. There's a ton of traffic downtown because of that movie that they're filming you know, from earlier. Definitely subscribe to the podcast and all my social medias. If you ever wanna work with me one-on-one, -on -one, the link is down in the description below. And until next time guys, Sumi out.